today I'm making these little miniature diaries with a faux lock. Uh, let's see if you're new to my channel and you like what you see, please feel free to click that subscribe button. And kids, do be sure and ask a parent for help before starting this craft. Okay guys, so let's get started. I select my craft phone. Cut it so that it is just over one inch tall. And then I make my mark at the one inch mark or just under. score it and then just scooting it over just a little bit I score it again and flip it over and score the other side and so you want your craft on paper to move pretty well so you may need to do this a few times and in fact in a second I end up using my exacto knife and then I'm just cutting off that excess and then I use my X-Acto knife when I score it to get a little bit more flexibility when I fold it. And then just again using my X-Acto knife to make a little mark. I cut that out. And then with tiny scissors on the back side of my craft foam, I'm just cutting out that little area, just making it a little bit wider. Then I cut out some wire. I fold it around a paper clip, and in fact you could use a paper clip, wire was just easier and I have it. And I'm cutting my wire to size, which you can see here. I push it through, and then where those little marks are, I can actually push my wire through my craft foam, and I leave a little bit of excess. Then I use my hot glue gun and I'm pressing it down here on a piece of parchment paper. And you want to make sure your wire is secure. Uh, and it was still a really tight fit so I made that section a little wider. Then I cut out my lined paper. The printable will be in the description section. I mark on my diary so that my paper is not too wide. And then I'm just folding it accordion style. And just trimming this excess so everything lines up. And I leave the front and back piece so that I can glue that to my actual diary. And I just glue the rest of it to the center part of my diary. And you'll probably want to wait until that dries, otherwise everything will kind of slide around. But then I glue the front and back pieces to the sides of my journal. And I take a thinner craft foam. And I like this little heart because it's glittery on both sides. And I'm just cutting out a square folding it over and trying my best to get a tiny little heart. It's not easy. If you can't be bothered, you could also just do a hole punch of your craft foam. And just shaping it. Then I cut off a piece of a paper clip, just using my wire cutters, and I glue my heart to the bottom. And you want to make sure that the green section, so this bit of wire here, does extend a little bit past your journal, so that way when your journal expands a little bit, since it's folded over craft foam, it will expand just a bit, it doesn't push your lock uh, up. And I just add a little sticker. Or you can make faces using craft foam cutouts. Guys, you are so totally good to go. Well, guys, I sure hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks, guys. Bye.